I want to challenge Gikaria. My friend honorable TM. Hakuna mamboga ama mbuto boda boda mwanichwa chini menyokana interest na shamba ya war memorial. One thing I want to assure you bwana Gikaria. The fire you can make noise is just here in Nakuru because you are a frog that is barking and the voice of a frog cannot stop a cow from drinking water. I saw yesterday the UDA the followers supporting Raila Odinga for the AU post. What are you celebrating? The question is, what are you celebrating? You know very well you cannot vote there. The only person that can vote there is William Ruto. The stone that builders rejected has now become the chief cornerstone in the continent. And yet, you know what you did when you took power. The first thing you did when Raila was in charge of his infrastructure in the AU, you wrote a letter you don't recognize him. Now he's going to be a boss. You must bow before him. Raila Sema, Raila Baba, Raila Baba, Raila Baba, Dupatike Jonataka. The opposition is not dead. What, what Raila has done, Raila has given us an opportunity to come out and give alternative leadership. Come out, fight for the people. Apana kukimbia pa kama Burizilu na haki tumuvia tini metoroka ni kafuatu wa ni kapigio simu, mtoto wangu kanyanganyo simu. Opara nya cannot make leadership. UDA whether you support Raila or not, Raila already has his votes out there. So I'm sorry for UDA that you have to vote Raila. If you don't vote Raila, you must vote Raila. If you don't vote Raila, you must vote Raila. Okay, welcome guys. This is Omosh Poa, a political leader na Kurutuan West, Captain Kap Bawad. Mimi mimi ndo ule MC mwenye nafanya kazi bila ofisi, bila mshara na MCA2B 2027. With me here is Honorable Sande Barezia. Barezia. Aliyewania kiti cha ubunge mwaka jana. Captain Bo eh, na, na Kurutan West constituency. Asanteni sana kwa kwa kukakutwalika katika mazungumzo ya sahi. Eh, Kenya inaendelea ni kuwa war memorial hii mambo na war memorial has got a lot of concern to the public kwa sababu ukiangalia vile vile wanasiasa wana handle hii mambo ya war memorial unakuta hawa wanasiasa wanakuwa confused kwa sababu where the law applies the law must be respected na everything should be done within the, the law kwa sababu it is the law that govern this country issue ya war memorial naweza sema wana siasa wako na njia mbaya ya ku grab kunyakua shamba ya war memorial and that is why they've been always intimidating lawyers and the judges Unajua judge anafanya kazi kulingana na sheria. Na lawyers they defend things according to the law. So unakuta mtu kama Gikaria. Gikaria MP na Kurutan West. Gikaria astahili akuja atoke nje na aseme kuwa hata yeye atakuwa ana atatoa vijana waandamane ili atao pia usishwe kwa kesi yenye inaendelea ya war memorial i want to challenge gikaria my friend honorable tm hakuna mamboga ama mbuto boda boda mwanichwa chini menyokana interest na shamba ya war memorial to be frank and open hii shamba ya war memorial relies within your wrangles it is between you eh, arama and uh, mburu so nyinyi ndio mko na interest sana kwa hii shamba ya memorial atujui what you are after so msijaribu kuchukua vijana maana wape pesa maana watuma kwa barabara ati ndio uandamane ati wawe wahusishwe kwa kesi inaendelea kuhusu wa memorial ile hali mnajua vizuri sana ah vijana hawana interest ah watu hawana interest onosweva kulingana na kesi inaendelea ya war memorial nataka kuambia mr gikaria hivi not everything is about guns 
kila sio lazima kila kila kitu ikihappen ni goons don't misuse vijana tm hiyo hizo pesa pesa zenye uduo napatia vijana shilingi 300 for just a day tafuta mahali a vijana wafanye wa, kazi in their numbers Awa mama wa wanahang mtaani wasishindage wakikuwa kikuona ati mweshi mweshi nipe mweshi nipe watafutie kazi wafanyi kazi ya kuandamana kwa, kwa, kwa kenyeji na wafeva wewe mwenyewe na marafiki zako hiyo ni kumisuse vijana hiyo ni kumisuse wa mama wacha sheria ichukue mwenendo inao staili wame moreo vile manajua vizuri sana Wame memorial mnajua vile iko na vile court orders imekuwa ikitembea iki na vile yes. order size hata zimetolewa na CJ yes wanza ku bring goods on board yes. each of them hiyo ni kumisuse vijana na mimi kama kijana it's a high time hatuta kukubali TM ushindage kila wakati kitu ikikusukuma una mobile vijana in the name of kuandamana jioni unopatia 300 300 ni Mia tatu ita sadi mtu nini. So I think TM to be honest pe, wewe mwenyewe ka, wewe na TM na na Mr. Mburu na governor ni nyinyi ndio mko na interest sana kwa hii shamba kwa kwa hiyo ya kesi ya wao memorial. Chukweni mawakili yenu iwawakilishe mali pale. Don't interfere with the peace of bwana in the name of kwa mobilize ati bwana mane. Aba repeat. Hakuna interest ya mwananchi wa chini yenye ko mali pale kwa shamba ya wa memorial hakuna maka my words hakuna ni wewe unataka usikizwe ama ama vitu zenye unataka happen is zionekane ukimobilize vijana kuwalipa pesa waende kuandamane let us do everything within the law cj i think this is the only first time ubefanya kazi nzuri sana mawakili hawatakuwa wana wanatishwa na wanasiasa naomba madam CJ Kome tafuta njia ya mwafaka ya kutia mawakili na majajes nguvu mpya nguvu ili wakifanya kazi zao wasifanye wakiogopa kwa kuwa intimidated na wanasiasa niliona wanasiasa jana wakisha press wakisema ati haki ya haki ya ya bwana inchi jaskizwa kwa kesi ya wa memorial nani 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 mwenye wa memorial na nani wako na interest kwa memorial mwana inchi mgani mwenye alitoka chini wakaona vile shamba ya wa memorial inafanywa ndio wa wangile katikati this is a purely political jungling between wana siasa na, na judiciary wanasiasa mpaka mjifunze kuheshimu court orders don't behave like your boss is behaving your boss is also always against the court orders from 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 morning to evening any court order your boss goes against so don't practice the same down here sisi kama wanaishi wa chini na sauti ya watu wa chini tuta make sure tunafuata vitu within the, the law and don't apply goods everywhere in fact where goods don't belong hiyo pesa enda uwape uwapatie wakule wakienda makwao don't use the kwanza size jua inawaka sana ukiza chukua watu jua shilingi ya tatu wapige nduru town that is the not that is that, that's not the right way to go karibu sana mheshimiwa asante sana bwana mheshimiwa thank you na furai kwa nani katika kipindi ya leo na yangu ni machache kuhusu maswala ambayo yanaendelea katika nchi ya Kenya na aswa kaunti ya Nakuru kuna mambo mawili matatu ambayo tunaona tumesahau kama watu kama wa Kenya tunapoongea sasa hivi uchumi wetu umesambaratika vibovu sana badala ya tu tunaongea kuhusu mambo ya uchumi katika bunge naona waheshimiwa kama David Gakaria wanaenda katika runinga kuongea mambo ya uo memorial na jambo la kusikitisha ni kwamba haya mambo ya wame moro yako kotini na kama jambo liko kotini haifai kabisa kuyaongelea ama kuleta siasa ndani yake one thing i want to assure you bwana kakaria the fire you can make noise is just here in nakuru 
because you are a frog that is barking and the voice of a frog cannot stop a cow from drinking water. So I want to assure you one thing, that war memorial is going to sink down with you in this county. Madam Governor Susan, you know very well the law is there and must be respected. Why can't you guys respect the court orders? By so doing, we bring sanity in the country. But if you don't respect the law, you are busy trying to come up with goons to justify what you did when they were doing their demonstration. To me, that's a fallacy of democracy because the law is the law and the law must be respected. If you are not going to respect the law, I saw yesterday the UDA uh, the followers supporting Raila Odinga for the AU post. What are you celebrating? The question is, what are you celebrating? You know very well you cannot vote there. The only person that can vote there is William Ruto. But you guys like Malala, you are neither here or there. Nini wengine yote ni pure, you are celebrating Raila is going. Raila is not gone. Raila has given birth to so many people that will keep this government on check. Yeah? The country with, uh, with, with no hope, no future. Look at our children are at home. They are not going to school. Education is something else. Life is unbearable. And you are not talking. You are waiting for Raila Odinga to take both the streets. Raila is going to achieve his dreams that he wanted to achieve inside here, in, in the country. But because you stopped him, look at what God has done. The stone that builders rejected has now become the chief cornerstone in the continent. And yet, you know what you did when you took power. The first thing you did when Raila was in charge of infrastructure in the AU, you wrote a letter you don't recognize him. Now he's going to be a boss. You must bow before him. Raila sema Raila Baba, Raila Baba, Raila Baba, ndo pati kenyo nataka. Au na mnagani? Ya mwisho ni kwangu ni kusema kwamba, the opposition is not dead. What, what Raila has done, Raila has given us an opportunity to come out and give alternative leadership. Because without alternative leadership, we cannot compare the leadership with the Oparanya of this world that when they see the police officers, they are running away, flying away. Kachonjo, shiku aweka ndani, come out, fight for the people. Apana kukimbia pa kama burizili una actu movie ya tinimetoroka, nikafuatu wa nikapigio simu, mdoto wangwa kanyanganyo simu. Oparanya cannot make leadership, ikama hindi jela. Apana wapa askari, askari pia naumia, vile pia unaumia. Yeah. Kalozo Musioka, Mata Karua, it's now your time now to come out and tell us what you are supposed to be doing. Give leadership. Araila out of the way for UDA means Kalozo is there, Mata Karua is the deputy, he's there. You have to stand up and help the country. I know by now Kenyans are very tired. Look at uh, court orders being uh, ignored. It's not only Nakuru. It is something, it's, it's the trend. A court order cannot be respected. Look at what happened in uh, 2017. There was a court order to open the servers. The servers were not opened. This 2022 to 22, there was a court order to open the servers. They were not open. Instead, they came and justified that they have opened the servers. And we know very well they were not open. Those, those matters that are there, they have to be revisited. In as much as you can have your way, but now respect us. Yeah? Mr. Gakaria and Madam Susan, I am appealing to you to talk to your to Gakaria to come down. Gakaria is a nobody, he doesn't know the law, he doesn't respect the law, he believes in the law of jungle. The law is the law and you must respect it. And one day it will catch up with you. My simple, I have a simple statement to tell Gakaria. Go to parliament and tell us, give us a framework on how you want to be enjoyed in this court, in this matter. Because a, a common mama, a common mama mboga has no interest whatsoever over the whole memorial thing. Yeah? A common mwanaichi boda boda has no interest. They cannot even afford to go there for treatment. So what I'm saying, I was not even to talk about this uh, war memorial thing. May I came in because of the interest of the court, when the laws are, uh, the courts are the place of the last results, and when the courts are ignored, then there's no country there. Where we are heading, we are courting anarchy. And when you court anarchy, we will go Haiti way, and we are ready. <laughs> Don't look for Haiti.
bring her, bring bring continue with what you are doing but slowly gradually it will graduate to something else and once it graduates you will see what you have never seen before those lawyers are not mad to take to the streets and they were peacefully demonstrating i was there with them but you brought goons thank god for the law enforcers who repelled them off why i'm simply telling you leo ni wewe ni sisi na kesho itakuwa wewe now when we catch up with you my friend there will be no mercy raila gone does not mean it's okay to impunity i want to assure you one thing if impunity when impunity thrives in a nation that's a downfall of a nation come back you lead us come back to the drawing board start thinking where did the rain started beating us fix the economy fix the security system don't brag of of of, of goons here because those goons have nothing to do you just come and manipulate them to fit your own stupidity i call them stupidity you go pay someone 300 to come at his protest what are you protesting for do you know anything to do the, with the memorial nothing nothing they know you have nothing they are very you cannot show us anything that you know you have just been paid to come wewe mama wewe mtoto wa boda boda mtoto yangu mtoto yangu mwenye nakujua i know our young boys there i know you usikubaliane na rakaria kukuleta kwa barabara ati amekupea shilingi mbili tafadhali akikuita chukua pesa jipe shughuli sawa sawa hiyo pesa ni yako alikuwa waachilie lakini jo wameharibu uchumi wanakuja kuwatumia kwa ushenzi kula pesa wachana mjinga aende sawa sawa Sasa. wakati mwema wa Kenya nataka mjua kwamba hatujasaulika with Raila Odinga exit from Kenyan politics that means we have to rise to the occasion and bring Kenya back to normal it is not over yet but we are coming up Raila Odinga has given birth to so many children around who can bring change that people can, can believe in so I wish you all the best but let us all be law abiding citizens even if you are in power and in the position of authority Tafadhali tuheshimu sheria. Mungu awabariki. Adding on that, adding on that, Raila Amolo Odinga, hate him or love him, is the center of is the center of gravity of Kenyan politics. Let let Baba acquire EU job. We support that 100%. Thank you very much. You dear whether you support Raila or not, Raila already has his votes out there. So I'm sorry for you dear that you have to vote Raila. If you don't vote Raila, you must vote Raila. If you don't vote Raila, you must vote Raila. It is Raila and Raila and Raila. So it is Raila morning. Raila, 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 Raila breakfast. Raila breakfast, Raila lunch, Raila supper. Daily, from January to December. You have created an enigma. Baba, I wish you well. Do what is right and make sure you make us proud. You've, we've been always proud of you and we know that you are the son of Africa mostly the son of Kenyan soil. We love you and we respect you. We are praying for you as you try to manage the affairs of the continent. Not the affairs of Kenya. The affairs of Kenyans are petty. God bless you. Baba, cheers. Here is the salamu ya Raila Kwenda EU.